Hi everybody, it's Christina here and welcome back to my channel. First off, this is really heavy. This is not all of the cookbooks I own. I just ordered about five more. Um, much to my uh, husband's dismay. But I did want to take a chance to go through some of these with you. And we're going to pick some recipe. Excuse me. Some recipes out because why not? We got the time. And we gotta find some dinner. So the first one we have, my husband actually got this one. <laughs> so, oh my god, I have the hiccups. I have no idea why. Honestly, this one I might just end up giving away because it's not really. <sighs> I don't know. It just it's not what we would really use. Plus, I'm pretty sure it was one of those Dollar Tree books, so I'm just going to put that off to the side for now. Um, So, I'm going to go through the Delish one. I did it kind of earlier, but it took a lot of time. So, we're going to just go ahead and go with the ones that have a little bit of paper in them to let me know what... Oof. That's got a lot of dog fur in it. Let me know which ones I want to make. So, I know my husband and I had gone through these a couple of weeks ago. Okay, so I wanted to try this egg in a whole sandwich, but now that I'm looking at it, I don't really want it. I'm not really feeling it this week. Also, I wake up, guys, last night, and I have this pimple here. I have, like, one here, and then I have one here, and I never really break out with, with pimples, so... Just tells you how stressful my life is becoming. That is a joke. My life is not that stressful. Um, this one actually it's called Patchcock Chicken. Spatchcock Chicken, sorry. Um, again, now that I'm looking at it, it doesn't look that appetizing to me. Honestly, if I'm being honest, none of the Pioneer Woman's recipes turn out well for me or end up how I like it this one I might keep because it's it's mesquite grilled chicken um I have to go over the ingredients and see what I have and what I need to buy okay next portobello bun mushroom or bun burgers I think I might go with this one because I love a good portobello bun my husband does not but I'm also like I want this, so I'm kind of like, I'm going to leave that one. And I think I want that one over the mesquite barbecue, or the mesquite chicken. And so, moving on with our next one. God, I cannot find my business chili cheeseburger. Okay, this looks really good, and it has no bun. But I really want the portobello mushroom. Also, I don't have five pounds of ground beef at the moment. So, there's that. Next thing, cauliflower fried rice. And I know my husband would not eat that. I didn't understand that. Shh, Bixby, nobody's talking to you. Chill. <sighs> okay, so I think the Portobello bun burger wins. And what I like is it will say, like, lower carb, um, quick and easy. So, that is my one from there. Oh, guys. Lord help this. Look at this. Okay. So, obviously, I'm not making breakfast, so. Oh, my neighbors home? Their dogs sound like they're out. They shouldn't be. They're not home. Okay. Um. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Chill. That's not going to happen. Also, I've noticed that she really likes using a lot of stuff in her uh, dishes. <coughs> Excuse me. Cannot take rid of this cough. <sighs> I'm fighting a cough in your room. Okay, so that's a breakfast item. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, I'm so sorry. My husband um gave us all the flu and then got us all sick um with a cold after that. So it's just been one thing after another with him. Okay, getting into it, we have a cat. 
We had pan whales, but I don't think that's really going to work for us. <clears throat> also, I'm kind of in a hurry because my husband's friend is coming over. We had a tree fall, and we just cut up the wood, and he's coming to get the wood, so... Because we have no need for it. <clears throat> I figured my husband might like this. It's hamburger steaks with mushroom gravy. He doesn't really like mushrooms, though. But also, we have, uh, we have, I think I might go with the Dr. Up Ramen. It says it's super quick. Problem is, it doesn't look very, you know, oh no, the salmon, the one he's going to want. I can tell you now, the salmon is going to win, because he loves salmon. It's not something I make for him very often, because salmon is expensive here. Um, he's not going to eat goat cheese. It feels, I feel bad for, like, wasting all my flags, but also I realize if I stick them off to the side, I can just reuse them. <clears throat> also, we can't really get lamb chops where I am. We have to drive an hour to get them, and they're kind of more of a, like, special occasion thing. Not a, we're just doing something up once a week. But, guys, so we're supposed to get bad weather today. And I'm very upset. Ooh, there's some cheese broccoli soup. Okay, I'm going to leave that here. Um, and uh, my the place that I work, everywhere around me, like in my town, has closed down. Like the public library has. Because I don't work where I live. I have to drive like most people. And uh, it's a good 40-minute drive. And uh, yeah, my town is completely like shutting down. But... My place of work hasn't, so I guess they're still expecting me to, um, show up. But also, I have to be very careful, because I don't want to wreck my car. Because <clears throat> I would be very upset if that happened, because they refuse to, uh... And also, I don't think it's quite fair that if... I don't, I mean, I live far away. I do. And, um, uh, so, I'm going to keep an eye on the road, and I'm going to have to make a call. So, I'm hoping they make that call before I have to go in tonight. I have until, like, 9 o'clock, because then I start heading to work. So, I'm really hoping that they do the right thing. But also, where I work, they don't shut down. They don't like shutting down. Shutting down means that people can't, don't have access to what they need. Which, I totally understand that. But we also have a thing called a snow crew, who, they live close enough, and they get, like, you get two times, um, you get, you know how regular, it's time and a half for overtime? Well, you get, um, two times and a half for, uh, in, in-house comp time. Which they told us not that we couldn't do, but then they go ahead and say do it. But I don't live close enough for that, so I'm not about to be like, hey, count me in. Alright, so some of our choices. Let's start at the beginning. We have honey soy salmon. Which honestly, a uh, slow cooker broccoli cheese soup. Which honestly, I'm probably just not going to go with that one. Uh, what's our next one? Next one is teriyaki salmon and kale sheet pan supper. Only problem I see is my husband does not like kale. So for that, um, we'd have to change it. And then Spanish salmon and sheet pan meal. Which, onions, bell peppers, green olives, I don't know. Nope. Sourdough, smoked paprika I have, salt and pepper I have, olive oil. Fillets um, and chopped parsley, which I have. Um, the only thing I'd, I'd have problem right now is the sourdough. I don't trust. So I think it would go with the, um, let's see. I don't have honey. I'd have to buy honey. I have so soy and salt. Well, I don't have kale. I do have olive oil. I don't have Okay, so I think I'm going to go with the honey soy salmon. 
So I'm getting like it just lowered down to the one I want every out of every book. The grilled cheese dog. My God, this looks so good. Um, I have to see how I can make it a little bit healthier. I kind of like the egg in the home. Cracked chicken. I think I'm going to use General So's wraps. Maybe. No, we're going to do the shrimp boil out of this one. Because my husband and I both love seafood. Guys, this is one that I really, really enjoy and I love. Um, I haven't cooked out of it yet, but I have looked at it. Um... there they go again <coughs> I want to try this Miguel Cuddy soup <coughs> excuse me that's what it looks like it looks interesting and you know okay so this one where well, I'll never go back I'm just gonna do play Russian roulette Oh my god, guys. I actually opened it up to the salmon page. <laughs> I know I'm not reading that right. Does that say salmon cheesecake? It does, doesn't it? Okay, um, we're just going to bypass that. So we have, uh, this one is actually one of my favorites because it's it does have a lot of healthier things. But uh, I am looking today for the best of the best of for dinner. And I don't need breakfast items at the moment. But dead gummits, if this doesn't look good. Also, I realized that I messed up on a bill last night. That one actually might work. Um, I still haven't bought a new Instapot, guys. It'll be okay, though. I actually did. Okay, so um, don't sleep on these, but these are the crisp uh, finger sandwiches. They're whole wheat bread, fat, uh, garden cheese, cream cheese, uh, English cucumbers, alpha, alpha, alpha sprouts, and ground pepper. We have made this one. So good. Even my husband liked it. Um, that is grilled steak. Nope, that's not. Orange tilapia. Um, I like tilapia, even though I shouldn't. Actually... I don't want to go with everything salmon, so I'm going to just, because salmon gets expensive. Like, no lie. For a salmon filet, here's about $20 on the cheaper end. So, I'm just going to pick one. I think I found what we're doing. <clears throat> I'm not doing salmon, sorry. Oh, ay ay ay. There's a chicken noodle soup that I kind of want to make, so I'm going to leave that here. I'm going to think I'm going to make soup for one week. Just get us thermoses. I'm waiting for my husband and child to get home, his friend to get here, which I hope his friend does not bring his fiance because right now I really just, I'm irritated by her. And that's on me, and I know that's on me. Okay, so I think I'm going to make... Either the mar personal margarita pizzas. I think I might do this for like a lunch for the week. And then, um, and put with it this uh, simple chicken noodle soup. I think that'd be great. Uh, oh, God, I have three things. Excuse me. Oh, that needs to go. <clears throat> I feel bad for wasting all these, but also I have them to waste. Okay, so next book. I feel bad for this. This is going to be a long video. Please don't watch the. I mean, I know if you don't want to watch it, then you already stepped away. So thank you for those of you who are still here. Um, if nobody's still here and I'm just talking to myself, hi self, it's fine. You know, life sometimes is like this. And while I would watch it, doesn't mean everybody will. And that is all I got to say about that. Because also, I'm not doing this for everybody else. I made this channel because I want, I wanted to do me. I wanted something for me. Okay, I think I found it. Okay, so the thing I'm going to do is another chicken noodle soup. Because I'm going to do a battle of chicken noodle soups. I'm going to do five, a Tasty Home versus Tasty. 
And this one already has one that I picked out. And it is called Easy Ravioli Lasagna. It is like five ingredients. Looks super easy, super tasty. Um, this one looks like it has two picked, so I'm going to have to uh, see which two. We'll go from there. Homemade cookie cereal. That's not a dinner thing. Um, frosted animal fudge cookie. That looks good, but again, not what I need. Okay. Um, ooh, what is this? What kind of fish are we using? Red snapper? I'm not sure I can get a red snapper really easy around here. My god, this looks so good, but also, like, <clears throat> grilled BLT salad. Oh, my gosh. I feel like I'm having a lot of soup, so I'm going to stay away from soup. This is, okay, so this all sounds good, but this is definitely when I'll have to, like, cheat. For. Okay, we're going to try some of these hot dogs. I think we're going to try the chip dog and the big cheese. So that is going to be our meals. Our meal. Also, because a pack of hot dogs isn't that expensive. <clears throat> oh, that's out of order. I grabbed them. I put that in the wrong. Okay, next one. We have HBO's True Blood. Um... Somebody, I bought my, I got this one for Christmas, but apparently they got it at TJ Maxx, so. TJ Maxx, here we go. I love TJ Maxx, so like, no hate to them. Okay, yes, Sookie Stack has drinks. Like I said, we're not really looking for drinks, so we're just going to skip the drinks. And it looks like the first part is breakfast, and while breakfast is usually good, it's not for me right now, so... Cajun potato, uh, we don't need any sweet potatoes. We're actually looking for some food. Can I have some food? Brujo burger. What is it making a, a wizard burger or a witch burger? Okay, I don't have button mushrooms where I live. What can I use instead? Okay, that's just, that's not a lot of ingredients that I don't think I can. Okay, we might do this one because it's called a Sloppy Jason. And if you've ever seen that show, which it is definitely a above, above 18 show. So, um, it's actually, if you, uh, if you definitely keep your remote on hand and, uh, skip some parts, if it's not bad. Okay, so I'm seeing all these, like, desserts, which is fine, but, like, I want some, like, food. Can I have some food? Potato skins are good, but not really, uh. Shrimp cocktail. What is this? Oh, that's alcohol. Another dead chicken sandwich. This really doesn't have anything like... I'm kind of disappointed in it, honestly. <clears throat> Did I kiss your grits? Ooh, crawfish fritters. But I have to fry them, and I'm trying to do better. And I don't want, like, to fry things at the moment. Oh, my God, there's a crawfish boil. Okay, we're just going to do the crawfish boil. That is the one, the boiling over engagement party. That is it. That's the one we're doing. All right, so we have one last one. Um, This is also... Sa this is um when I got for Christmas. Also, no hate to people who don't buy their books new. I think, honestly, you're being smart about that. Um, my dad actually did check with me. This is a previous library copy. And I don't care because um, 
the box is in good condition. I mean, it's gonna, like, it's got its wear and tear, of course, but I'm not here to, like, beauty. I'm here to cook from it, so, like, I'm fine. Okay, so I'm gonna skip all the power hacks and hunting and fishing and preserving meat, and we're gonna, like, find some actual meals. We don't need breakfast, so I'm just gonna skip past the breakfast. Okay, so I do love fish. Like, I love fish. So, I'm thinking I'm going to go with fish. Because, honestly, I do. I love fish. I can eat it most every day. Cucumber and onion salad. I already made that. Wild boar. Squirrel. Picante. Picante? I don't know. I'm... Most garden vegetable melody. Scout potatoes. And then we get sweet treats. <clears throat> okay, so again, not very many recipes. So I think I'm going to have to go with the campfire fish fry. Also, guys, this book usually goes for around $30. And you get that. And, like, most of the pages, the first, like, let's see. Excuse me. The first 30, four pages are like survival tips, <coughs> which is helpful if you're wanting to survive. Okay, so um, thank you guys for coming along. This is a really long video, and I am so sorry. But uh, we picked up meals for when my husband and I want to cook. That is all that I have. <coughs> have a wonderful day. I will see you guys later. Bye.